Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how we can create this amazing walling game using MIT App Inventor. So in the last tutorial, we already have learned how we can play this game. Okay, I'll show you how we can create this game. Okay, so as you can see here, what I have done here, it's really very easy. Okay, so let me show you the design what I have done. So I have added here three component first is a clock, notifier and sound. Okay, then now I have added one layout that is vertical arrangement like this in this arrangement i have added here canvas okay what is canvas i have added and in the canvas i have added one image spread and one wall so see that this is the image spread and i have added one wall so i have added that wall y is 500 so let me just make it 200 so i can show you like this see like this done and in the this here i have added one horizontal arrangement and i have added two labels one label is for three this is for chance like how many chance you have to hit that walling and I have another label that will display the random number okay that we will generate using the clock and that will decide our wall speed okay done so this is the overall design and i have added one sound walling sound as you can see here let me just preview it like this this and another one is the hitting sound like like this okay and i have added one balling png this is the png okay this is the image i will publish this game don't worry so you will find all assets okay now let's do the coding part how i have done the coding let's go to the blog see uh now let me just show you a step by step so what i have done first i have initialized the count by three okay so whenever someone touch the ball whenever someone touch the ball and we have make the ball point toward the target target is image spread okay and the ball speed should be the label one dot text whatever the label text value that ball speed should be same okay and set sound source to the balling one and play the sound so whenever we click on the ball the sound will play so what is that this label one how this will decide so as you can see this is the code for this i have added the random integer from 12 to 15 in the label and by clock so as you can see go to the design see the clock and you'll see the time interval is 100 it means this watch will run this timer will run 10 times in one second so this value label value will change 10 times in one second Okay, and this will define to 12 to 15. So I can make it 5 to 15. Done. So whenever you whenever you touch the ball, so make sure your ball speed should be higher. Okay. Right. So otherwise uh, your game will over. Done. Now let's see what's the condition for the game over or for the winner. So see when the ball collide, okay, it means whenever the ball collide, this ball collide with image spread. What will happen? This will call the sound play so this will play the sound simple as that if get other get other means other is equal to image spread get other is a component okay if that component is component is image spread then we have to check if the ball dot speed is greater than and equal to 12 okay and how will define this so we know the ball speed and the ball speed will randomly get from the clock Whenever someone user touch the ball, so they need to make sure the ball should be whenever they click that should be greater than 12 or equal to 12. If it's equal or greater than 12, then image speed dot visible to false. It means that balling will visible off. It means you hit the right balling. Okay. And the ball speed should be zero and that ball move to the horizon. Okay. X and Y value. At the same time, we have to display one, you know, notifier that good job message title should be status, button should be next game, please, and cancelable should be false. See, that's the set global count. We need to make that global count three again, and that global count is this design. This is three. Okay, go to the block. Now, see the set ball is speed. Now, if see, if this ball is speed okay is less than 12 okay if it's 11 or 10 or something then what we will do will ball set speed to zero okay this is important because we have to make our ball uh, stopped we have to move our ball in the same condition 
you can use you know uh, you are using the again repeating this so you can create a procedure where you can put that uh, code here and you can call the procedure here instead of again calling the code then you need to set the global count minus one because you have three chance that's why i just minus one then set this label two dot value to global count display that value and get global count is equal if <clears throat> this is done okay you have to run like this if global count is equal to zero once you have three chance and all are gone then make sure you have to just display the message is game over status is next game state title is game over status and the message is game over and button is like next game please and cancelable is false and the call now overall all the happen this okay so at the end you need to just add here call a stop count should be a stopped then so that's the overall game okay and this is one more thing here as you can see here notifier after choosing so whenever we choose the notifier you know whenever we uh, start the game so whenever we choose the notifier like okay next game so this image speed will display okay so that's the overall game that we have created and that's really very simple code so what i will do i just make it publish to gallery so you can you know use this code and modify that code and try to make some more interesting or try to add some more interesting feature in this game and share this game with your friends so game wall description balling game by the coding bus okay so just credit to the coding bus simple and more info so i'll just add just here the coding bus only nothing else and uh, check here yes, searchable image oh this is image important so do you have any image here no i don't have image so i will just do with wing dot create and i'll just create one image and i'll publish it that's really great let's create this just download this icon to submit this oh that's really great done so you can just search game ball okay this is a game name okay and just use it so that's the overall game if you have any doubt you can ask on ask me on comment please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video if you have any idea related to apps unrelated to games related to robotics anything just comment on the video i'll try to make your app next thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye